What's, What's good, Fish Fam? Today we're going to be going to summer gymnastics camp and it's a whole week of gymnastics. Are you and excited? And it's my first day of gymnastics camp. Yeah, it's her first summer camp. I've been to one before, but she's going to be coming with me this time. I'm super excited. I need to do my hair. Karma and me are already all dressed. Da, da, da. So I need my hair supplies first. Karma's gone to pack her bag. As I said, I need to do my hair. I don't even need to use gel because it's wet. I've just washed it. As soon as I put gel in, it gets greasy again, which is very annoying. So I was thinking, is there even any point in washing it? But because it's wet, I don't need to put any gel in because the water acts like gel. When it dries, of course, it won't look like slick back or gel hair or anything, but I'm all right with that. So I just smooth it out and then I've got this special little rainbow scrunchie. Can you take my lunchbox out? So Karma's lunchbox, the lid is really loose, so I need to tape it up for her. But we've got toasty, which I made, and tomatoes, <laughs> and blueberries, <laughs> and tortilla crisps. We made it on time, didn't we, yeah, girls? We did. So girls, what are your intentions for today? Karma, first of all, can I ask you a question? Yeah. What do you want to do today? Um, I want to do splits. I'm a proper platform stand. Do you want to learn the splits this week? Is yeah. that what you'd love to do at summer camp? Yeah. Yeah, well, how about you? I've been uh, doing that handspring spotted, which means like support. So you want to do the splits and you want to learn unassisted back handspring. You want yeah. to improve that. Oh, that yeah. sounds really good. The other thing yeah. I want to get is a back and roll to handstand. So you like I just need to hit the handstand like straight, so I think I am going to get that. Nice! Uh, and I wish I could wear my ballet shoes for gymnastics, oh. but I can't. You know, no. I have shoes for gymnastics. You're doing your leotard and you know need to, you haven't, you're not wearing a leotard today. No, I'm not just wearing shorts. I okay, wear yeah. shorts and a leotard. Yeah? Well, that's what you need your heart with the boots. Okay, then girls, you better get ready. We're going to stand in the line, shall we, to get you registered? Yeah. Yeah, have fun today. Have fun. Back home now. I had a good time at gymnastics, but I'm really tired. We did vault, and we also practiced doing round-offs and cartwheels, and we did air track as well. What did you do? I practiced the splits. Did you? And I did them really well. Well done. Oh, well done. Did you really practice it today? Yeah. Did you? No, I need to like, do all those things that I told you about. I was also practicing my handstands. And I've been trying to like do them where your legs aren't just straight where they're like in different poses. But it's not really working that well. <laughs> and I've also been practicing elbow stands. And we played loads of games. We played like this one, it's called the jellyfish game. That was really fun. We played the animal game. It's where you have to get in like different poses. And we also did some like partner acrobatics. And then we had to like do all these balances and that. So that was really fun. Good morning! It's day two and I'm gonna be making snack and Carl's gonna be helping me. Carl, but you will not believe what mum got us for snack. Do you wanna see? I'm gonna, we're gonna have carrot slices, but also, look, cookies! Are you excited? And I'm we're gonna be having them. mulberries. Put one in yours. And then I'm gonna make carrot slices. We can also have some mulberries. Put some mulberries in mine. I'll cut them in small slices so they fit. And put them in there. Yay, they fit perfectly. Gonna have some healthy things as well as the cookies. The cookies got chocolate I know, chips. they're chocolate chip and chocolate vanilla cream. Chip. I've never tried them before. Very excited. And that's our snack done. We're now about to leave. I'm all ready and Karma's ready too. Lots of you guys in the comments have given me loads of gymnastics tips and I really find them helpful. So if you have any more for me, like especially about back handsprings, I would really appreciate that. So could you comment them, please? I'm all ready, I'm excited. You're tricking me. What? I'm not tricking you. You need to do me. your hair and wash your hair. I'm ready. Oh, <laughs> I can't believe you just said that. My hair looks good. It's so scruffy, see? Ha! She just said my hair's scruffy. Well, maybe I'm not ready. Bye, Bye. Have fun. I've got banana hands. Yeah. See you later. Bye, 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 B
Woo. I had an amazing day. First of all, I've been practicing back handsprings. Being spotted, I had them almost perfect. I was about to try by myself, but the break time came. And then after break time, I we did vault and then we also did dance and then after that was another break and then we did air track again and then i was practicing my back handsprings again but they weren't nearly as neat or good but i did try one by myself i was so oh, happy wow. about it it was very messy very not neat but i'm gonna do them again and i'm i'm so happy i'm so happy yeah you, i'm really happy i can really tell <laughs> i win the medal because i have a stick one is that your medal yeah what is uh -huh. it let me have a close-up i don't super know. gymnast <gasps> High five, Karma. High five. So what did you do today then? I know you won a medal, but what for? Um, from doing cartwheel and handstands. Yeah. Show me your cartwheel progress then. <gasps> Karma, that's improved so much, honestly. Wow. And while we were warming up, we did bridges and then I was doing my bridge. I looked across and Karma was doing a perfect one. It, yeah. Her head was off the floor. She's obviously Ready? tired now. But look, Ooh. but her head was proper off the floor because she was like fresh and she had lots of strength. Wow, come on. Good girl, push, push. Wow. I was honestly, wow. I was so shocked. You're so strong. Well done. Look at look, that determination. Big gap, big gap in wow. her head. All that strength. Well done. Well done. I can remember when Karma first started gymnastics and even before the summer break on her weekly Saturday morning class, her cartwheels were like basically like all the other young children and they're not like really a proper cartwheel. They're just kind of, they kind of just put their hands on the floor and sort of like do a bit of a bunny hop. I can't really explain it that well. They they don't, uh, uh, you know, I'll it's not a proper cartwheel because they're just I'll learning. I'll show you how he did. A bit like that. Yeah, yeah, but now you actually go over and your legs are straightening out. I see. That's really, really good. You have improved so much and I'm so proud of you. Sarah. Yeah, I also did front handsprings today. Um, they're really hard yeah, to do yeah, off. This oh, hang on, Karma. Oh, brilliant. Good wow. girl. They're really hard to do off a block, but I've got a video of me doing that. It's, I wasn't too good at it though, but um, I've been practicing them and I'm almost better I've at back handsprings than I am front handsprings, which is I, funny. I, I, Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. I'm really happy with how my back flexibility has improved. Oh. <gasps> wow, you just got into that. It's like, I don't know. And my back is very smooth. <laughs> so she had to do a dance performance. Yeah, I did okay? a dance as well. It was, it was a bit interesting. Yeah. But, um, I did like a, a lift oh. where my friends like lifted me up while I was in a straddle. And, oh. and then we did like this thing where I'm laying on the floor and then they held my arms and then I like, you know where people, where they like swing and jump up? Yeah. Basically it was like that, but with them helping me. Oh wow, it feels like yeah. you two had a really good day yeah, today. Yeah, I had a great day. And tomorrow I'm really excited because I get to practice back handsprings again and I'm gonna do one. Oh my goodness, exciting news. Say it again, Sienna. My gymnastics teacher said that if I keep up doing my back handsprings and if I master them, which I am gonna do this week, I'll be able to move into the squad class. Yeah, it's been it's been my gymnastics like goal. It's like the class that's above mine. Um, and you can only be invited to go into it, so you can't just like go into it if that makes sense. You have to be like build it up, and then they'll say if you can go in or not. So I'm really excited for that. And it's usually my gymnastics class is for an hour and a half, but it's for two hours. And there's loads of amazing gymnasts in there who can do all these like really good flips and that. And so wow. I'm wow. really excited. Hard work's paying off. Yeah. yeah. How to do all of them then? Yeah. It'll be good for you to be around them girls. And yeah. today I did. A real cartwheel and a real bridge. Wow! Yeah. Yeah. That's amazing. Hey Fizz fam, it is day three. And I am gonna be showing you my stretching. I have shown you this before, but I want you to compare how much I've improved. I'm really happy with how much I've gotten lower in my splits and everything. So that's what I'm gonna be doing, splits. I'll start with the box, I think. I'm gonna do the froggy stretch. That's what it's called. And then you stick one leg up. I am a bit sore, I must admit. And then the other one. And then the both. I'm not too happy with that. It didn't, it wasn't the best of 
done before, but now I'm gonna do front. This is my good leg. I am very sore. I think I slept in a bad position because my shoulders really hurt, but I'm sure I'll go away. This is my left leg split. And then I'm gonna do right leg. I dread this one. I don't stretch before gymnastics every day because like sometimes I don't really have time or sometimes I really don't feel like it because stretching twice is the pain twice. It is worth it because it will really help you improve. And slide into splits. <sighs> Ow, I feel the burn. I think that's all the stretching I'm gonna do for today till actual gymnastics class, but I'm really excited for today because I'm gonna do a neat back handspring by myself. I know I am and I can't wait. I love gymnastics camp. <laughs> also, today Mia's gonna be taking us because mum and dad are at the gym. We're gonna be leaving soon, pretty soon because I'm ready and I think Mia's ready and Karma's ready so we can go. Mia's doing her makeup. Hey Fizz Bam. What are you doing? A bold look, like bright purple. No, I'm literally just putting mascara on and then going. Oh! I don't have time to do loads of makeup today. I'm taking you to gymnastics. Thank you, Mia. You're Thank welcome. you so much. Hi. Hi. Guess what? I did a back walkover today. My first ever time. Well and, and look, I got a prize for it. See? I actually did it. You did it today. First time ever. A back walkover, not back handspring. They're different. Wow. Yeah. But, but sorry, Sienna, for getting it. My don't worry, it's fine. Well it's done. You lean back High and then five. like. I've only got a sticker. Stickers are so boring. Well, Why is it not really? The teacher did say that you're definitely not going to get a prize because she was speaking when she taught you to be quiet. You can't get a prize today, okay? But maybe next time. Maybe next time. Oh, don't worry. Well, guess what? I've got a really fun surprise today for you and Sienna and Mia. We're going to have a girly afternoon. Yay! Fun. I've got something special. Should we go home and get your change? Uh, yeah. Come on, I think she's tired. Mm. Come on. We're already now Fizz Fam for our girly afternoon, but we didn't properly get to hear about Sienna's massive achievement today. I did a back walkover, and the thing is, I've never really thought of like trying it by myself because. I only, about three months ago, I learned how to do a kickover and that's like the one down from a walkover. I wanted to perfect the kickover before even thinking about trying the walkover. And then my friends were like, why don't you try it? I'm like, okay. And then I took like three goes and I did it. Wow, and I'm really, really, really happy. Wow. High five, that's amazing. And can I tell you, what? I did a wheel bridge and a wheel cartwheel. Do you want me to yeah? show you my cartwheel first? Oh yeah. look, Dad's there. So you can tell him as well. Dad, yeah. I did a back walkover by myself. Did you? Yeah, do you want to see a video? Oh there? nice. You've been to the garden centre, haven't yeah. you? <laughs> <laughs> oh wow, nice. Yeah. Is that in slow mo? Uh, no. I'm going to keep on practicing and get it to be faster and faster. Nice, that's really yeah. By the way, girls, you all look beautiful we're for our girly yeah. afternoon. Yeah. So we're going to be heading into the centre of London. We're all dressed up and we're going to treat Sienna and Karma to something super tasty. Ooh, yeah. yum! Yeah. I'm excited! Yeah. Sushi time! Yay! <laughs> you got to try and catch it. Yeah. Do you want to catch the beans? One there. I get it. Salad. No. no, no. Okay. Can you get some? Yeah, yeah. No, just get one. Come and look at the beans. Look, the edamame. <laughs> Yay! Woo! High five. Now we need to try and get some sushi, don't we? It is officially day four of gymnastics camp. I'm kind of sad it's starting to come to an end, but I've still got all of today left and all of tomorrow left. So I've got ages still, but I'm really excited for today. I'm gonna do loads of back walkovers and try and perfect them and practice them loads. And I really hope to do a front walkover because I can handstand into bridge. I can stand up from bridge. I haven't really ever like tried putting them all together. So I'm gonna practice that today. And then also we're gonna do back handsprings again today. I'm super excited for that. I hope I can get one, like a neat one by myself. Today I've decided I'll show you all of my leotards. So first of all, there's this one, which I'm wearing. I feel like it is my favorite because it's short sleeve. With leotards, it's hard to find ones that fit you or like fit me because I either get my actual size in clothes and it fits me well or it's too big 
big or too small. I find it so confusing. This one fits me perfectly. It's not too tight and uncomfortable like some I have. And it's not too loose and baggy like some I also have. And also it's short sleeve, so it's like super practical, not too hot. And the design is lovely. My favorite color, pink. And then like sparkly and butterflies. I love it. Anyway. I'm talking too much about this one leotard. I need to show you them all. I have this pink one with the black and the silver and then the sparkles. I really like this one, but it's super thick because it has like a lining. So this one will be good for winter, maybe not so much summer, and it is still summer right now. And I want to enjoy the summer. <laughs> and then I also have that one in purple. I also love this one. And I like the shade of purple because it's like super shimmery. I think it's really pretty. Look at that. And then I have this one, or oh, it was the wrong way around. This one is a bit too small for me, but I love it so much because it's so like fancy and I feel like it's elegant because like it has a little skirt. This one sort of reminds me a bit of like dance, like ballet or something. If it was pale pink, it'd be like a ballet leotard. And then I have this one. I really love this one. It fits really good. And the neck is so pretty because it clips up at the back and then it, it's like almost like a turtleneck, I think it would be called. And yeah, it has all the sparkles and the pink. I love sparkles if you can't tell, and pink. And then I have this one. It's so pretty. It sort of reminds me of like, ice skating it's a skirt again and it's got like this mesh top and then all the little like sparkles the only problem is if you're wondering why i've never worn this one i've had it for ages but it's way too big and you can't return it so i'm just keeping it and waiting till it'll fit me i'm really sad about that one because i love it and i was hoping i'd be able to wear it for my birthday but it's baggy like i'm wearing a jumper or something and then i have another one which is also too big for me but this one's super pretty look it has all the sparkly like flowers and then it's pink and white and then it has like this mesh at the top but yeah it's also like i'm wearing a jumper it's very annoying some are too small some are too big some fit right i'm not sure between my club leotard and this one i'm not sure which one is my favorite because i love this one because it's like a nice dark velvet um dark blue velvet and then it's like light blue and dark blue like sparkly and then the sleeves they do do ones in short sleeves as well so it would look like kind of like that but i've got the long sleeve one and that is my leotard collection i also want to tell you guys what we're having for snack we're having these we got them yesterday when we were out and got sushi we also got these vegan sour cream and onion like vegetable crisps and i'm really excited to try them apparently karma's tried them before and she says they're really good so i'm excited and we're also gonna have some fruit maybe blueberries and apple with that but yeah back home now fizz fam and our little yeah. gymnasts are here did you have a good day yes yeah what yeah i had a great day i had to do a lot of conditioning but it was worth it because we got to do back handspring and i've been practicing my back walkovers as well i haven't mastered the front one yet but i'm working on it i'm going to show the fizz fam that i'm jumping down the camera thing the first one i'm going to climb up I like your um, outfit. Your yeah, I'm jumping. Yeah. I'm so close in them. I'm quite sweaty. <laughs> Wonder. Three, two, one. Whoa! 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 Whoa!
Me as a rock climber. Woo! <laughs> go on, go on, let's, you're doing really well. That's really good. Well done, Mia. Really good, clean pull ups. Oh, nice. Wow. Nice, Mia. Go for four. What? Go on, go on, pull, 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 pull. Pull, chin up to the bar. Nice. Wow. That was really good. Wow. That was amazing. Nice, nice work. High five. <laughs> Done. And then bubbles. Wow. You get this in and then you blow it really gently. What did you win that for? What did you do? A proper cartwheel. Did you? Yeah. Really? Well, your legs went straight in the air? Yeah. Come on, high five. I'm really proud of you. Come on. I'm so happy. Where's Sienna? Um, she's in the classroom. I got you some rice cakes. The salt and vinegar flavour. Yes. You happy? Yeah. I win bubbles. Well done. Hi, Sienna. Hi. You forgot to vlog this morning. Bye. Yeah, I know. Tell the first back. It's day five. It's the last day. You won a prize? Yeah. Oh, nice. She's really happy now because uh. she didn't get one the other day because she was being a bit like talkative. Oh, uh, nice. I did a real cartwheel with my feet up into the air. Wow, I wish I could see that, Karma. You have to show me. You have to show me at the campsite. That's where we're now going, Karma. Yeah, do you want to go camping? Yes. Hey, guys. I had an amazing time at gymnastics. It was a bit different today. We did less of like exercise and less, we didn't even do any conditioning. And we did loads of games. We did this handstand game where there's two circles. The inner circle have to hold on to the outer circle's feet while they're doing a handstand. And then they have to quickly like swap. It's really difficult. You've got to hold your handstand for ages, but it's really fun. And I won once, but yeah. Right. <laughs> woo -woo. Well done. <laughs> I know, I completely forgot, I'm sorry. Today for breakfast we had avocado and toast with olive oil, some salt and lime juice. And avocado. Yeah, oh yeah, and avocado of course. Yeah, at gymnastics we did more like um, flick practice and I did one off the trampet, it's like mini trampoline onto a crash mat by myself. I'm really wow. happy about that. We also played this game called pairs, it's where you have to get in pairs and then like do different shapes. Like there's one called Romeo and Juliet, one called spaghetti bolognese, one called racing car and there's like all different things. That was really fun as well. And then we also did beam, we did a mount, um, you could do whatever mount you wanted. And then we did straight jump, tuck jump, then round off off. What's so, a mount? Yeah. Nice. Um, a mount is the way to get on. Did you get what you want from this week at summer camp? Did yeah. you learn all the skills you wanted to? Yeah, I'm really happy. I've got two, I learnt two new skills that I didn't really even dream of, like learning. Back handspring, I, I never knew I was that close. Walk over, I'm really happy about that because that's like a significant skill that I needed to learn, but I had never really tried it before. But yeah, I'm really happy about that. Aww. Us, yeah. yeah. You try and teach me. Going into squad as well, yeah, my coach said she's gonna like email the head of the like gymnastics club and then I could have a trial lesson for it. Wow, yeah, so That's I'm really so excited happy. for that. That's so exciting because you've been talking about this for literally months. Ever since yeah. you joined the club, you've been like, I want to be in the squad. Yeah, and I it's thought finally happening. I thought I'd go in the squad like next summer. That was my goal. It's way sooner. It's like not even autumn yet. It's going to be the autumn for her soon. So Fizz Fab, Sienna is a perfect example of when you're really passionate about something and you put your mind to it, that is a powerful combination and you can achieve anything that you want to achieve. Isn't that right, Sienna? Yeah. Dream, um, plan, achieve. Yeah, so have the dream first, believe it, and then you've got to take the right action steps to get towards it. Dream it, it, believe it, achieve it. Yay, some family fears wisdom there for you. And also Fizz Fab, we're going to be spending the weekend camping as a family. So there's going to be six of us squished into a tent so we're going to be sharing all of that on family fizz instagram story so check that out i'm going to save a little highlights on there for you as well and also guys see us next week for a family fizz good old juicy q a so we can catch up you've got lots of questions oh, for nice. us we've got lots of things to share with you as well which is coming up so i think a q a is needed right now we love you so much fizz fans see, see you in the next video, video. bye, bye.